Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up the Galaxy Tab 3 Lite. So, first we're just going to start off by going into the menu after selecting our language. Then we are going to find out which uh, Wi-Fi uh, we have available. So just to let you guys know, you always want uh, to start up your tablet for the first time in a Wi-Fi location. The reason is because this way it restores the tablet uh, the way your other devices have been. So you always want to make sure this is available to you. All right, so now we're going to uh, log on to our uh, network right here. And I'm going to hide this off screen, of course, just for a second. And once you type in your password, you will then connect to the network. And then we will go to the next step. So from here, uh, we are just going to select our time zone. Which I'm not sure why I didn't select it automatically. Normally it will do that. And there we go. You understand, of course, everything that's going on. Press next. And then from here, you want to sign into your Samsung account. If you don't have one, this is fine. This is uh, mainly used to do a couple of things from uh, logging on to uh, certain uh, sites on, like, say, your home or uh, home computer chat on, which is like an instant message. And also to kind of restore certain things such as uh, wallpapers and things such as that. So I will sign into mine again off screen, of course. Generally, this is also how you register your device. So you do want to do this eventually so you can get those uh, Galaxy perks that you heard about when you first uh, turned uh, on the device and read the flyer for the little perks they give you. So let's restore it. And sure, why not? Not sure which device that was. And then we are going to sign into our Google account. Now this is very important because you want to sign into your Google account so that you can buy apps, even if they're free apps. You cannot do any you cannot do anything apps wise or game wise without going into a Google account. So if you don't have one, you need to create one now. All right, then we're going to go next. And we can see now that it is restoring. And as it says, it can take up to five minutes. It really depends on how much you have downloaded in the past on your previous devices. And for this part, we're just going to go next. You always want it to be available to uh, find your location because certain apps can only work if it can find your location. If it can't, the apps won't work themselves. And you can sign to Dropbox if you want. Uh, let's see, I will do device, Android guy. Uh, not LT. <laughs> Light. And the reason why you name your device is just so if other devices connect to it, you know what it's called. And there you go. Now we have uh, the official start screen for the Galaxy Tab 3 Lite. Do you have any questions about this? If you do, feel free to ask in the comment section down below. Thank you for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.